Cut. That's a good shot. That's what we're looking for. That's it. Good. Be under control, Todd. Shot. Good. That's all you got to do. It's, uh, it's pretty surreal being back on campus. I mean, uh, I always knew I'd come back eventually. You know, just didn't think that it would be pre-30 years old. Um, it's really only been about five years since I've left Amherst, and uh, it's been pretty wild. It's, it's been really uh, a great experience seeing a lot of the people that have, uh, you know, really helped my uh, career and my life and, and, and go into the way it's, the direction that it's gone, and see all those people and be able to, you know, say hello on, on a regular basis has been great. The ball is the most important thing that is our responsibility. It's the football. Okay, so that means turnovers, decisions, throwing the ball away, all that kind of stuff is what, that's what this position is all about. Right now for me, obviously, an opportunity to learn the playbook a little bit earlier than a couple guys coming in this summer. Um, and just a chance to work with my teammates. Obviously in high school you don't have it, so it's a new thing in college. And, you know, I think it's, it's really beneficial for us. Get your eyes there sooner, Todd. Come on, because that's why you're just, it's just throwing it. You're never seeing it. You're just throwing it. So much better, Ty. You're more under control and you're seeing it. Really, we're, we're still in the, in the phase we're teaching how to, how to take a snap from under center and take a three-step drop, a five-step drop, a seven-step drop, and hand the ball off. So those are type of things that, you're right, he has not done in a long time. So that's muscle memory. We need to kind of really work that thing throughout the, you know, the next 13 practices. But he's picking it up. He's doing a good job. The terminology is a little bit wordier than he's used to. Well, clearly it's more because all they do is signals, you know. So it was no huddle. He's not used to saying a play in the huddle and having to go out and execute it. So that right there is a challenge in itself. I'm going to show you the Montana tape. It's like a really good second step is what gets it. It's a really good second step. One more. Here we go. Here we go. It's the really good second step that's the key. Those guys are just so eager to learn. Uh, they're so eager to uh, get better, and I think that, uh, that, that that goes a long way. You should be here, one, two, three, four, five, and be throwing. Get your head and eyes there on three at least. A.J. Doyle's obviously played a lot of snaps, and um, you know I want him to act like that. I want him to act like he's played a lot of snaps and bring that kind of confidence and leadership to this huddle. And uh, Todd Stafford's a guy who's, who's obviously got some pretty uh, pretty good intangibles in terms of throwing the football. He can really let it rip. Uh, we just got to kind of hone it in a little bit and, and get the, uh, the mental part a little bit going. Run to me. That's so much better. Last year I was battling an injury throughout spring. So this year, you know, I'm more close to full health. Uh, this year, obviously, it's a little bit different because of the new playbook. Hurry up, hurry up. Take the hat hot to the flat, okay? Go gun, go gun. Go gun. It's more just getting used to dropbacks. You know, I haven't done a dropback pass since I was in Pop Warner. You know, I've been in the gun since high school. So it's, it's working on those threes, those fives, those seven step drops is, is really difficult. One, two, three, here we go. Better, don't just don't jump back too much like, a fade, like Jordan fade away, drive it. Anytime you're, you're in a, uh, a practicing phase, you're, you're competing. But right now, we're, we're, we're competing to get better. You know, we're competing to get better in reps and, and execution, and we're just trying to figure the thing out right now. But, you know, come camp, you know, you're competing to get out on the field. And I think that that's a little bit of a different competition. You're hoping that you come into camp and you're not really relearning uh, the system. Right now, you're learning the system and competing to get better. When you come into camp, you know the system, and you're just competing for playing time. I like to you know, do that when we're with the backs, is meet, meet me. So you're not even thinking about him, you're just thinking about running to a, a spot and meeting him at the crossroads. You know what I mean? So you're never even really looking at him. You're kind of just going to a spot and then he just happens to intercept the ball. It doesn't really matter who we bring in. I mean, the best, the best guy's gonna play. And um, that, that, that goes top to bottom at every position, I'm sure. But specifically at the trigger position, we need somebody that we can trust and um, that knows the system and that uh, can come in and execute. And, and I think that uh, the guys that are here can, can do that for sure. So we're not worried about that. And we just want the best guy to go out and, and compete for the job, you know, when the time comes.